Hello, Connor. I thought you might enjoy a little cruise. I love this place. Everything is so calm and peaceful, far from the noise of the world. Tell me, what have you discovered? I'm having difficulties with Lieutenant Anderson. He's unstable, even hostile. He shot me in the head last night. My relationship with Lieutenant Anderson is problematic. He continues to struggle with psychological issues. I suspect it clouds his judgment regarding deviance. Nothing matters more than your investigation. What's happening is too important. Don't let Anderson or anyone else get in your way. I found two deviants at the Eden Club. I hope to learn something, but... They managed to escape. That's too bad. You seem so close to stopping them. I went to the Eden Club, but I didn't learn anything new. That's disappointing. Looks like another missed opportunity. I found two deviants at the Eden Club. I hope to learn something, but I had to destroy them. You seem lost, Connor. Lost and perturbed. Perturbed? No. No, of course not. Why would I be perturbed? I thought I knew what I had to do. But now I realize it's not that simple. I'm just frustrated with my lack of progress. But I'm determined to accomplish my mission. The investigation is more challenging than I anticipated. But I have no doubt that I will solve this case and stop the Deviants. You had your gun trained on those Deviants at the Eden Club. Why didn't you shoot? We need the Deviants intact for analysis. Shooting them wouldn't have taught us anything. They were out of range. If I had the opportunity to stop them, why wouldn't I? You tell me. I don't know. I don't know. If your investigation doesn't make progress soon, I may have to replace you, Connor. I understand. I know I will succeed. All I need is time. I am of no importance. The mission is all that matters. Something's happening. Something serious. Hurry, Connor. Time is running out. Why did you shoot me last night? Who cares? You're back this morning, aren't you? Some fragments of memory are lost every time I'm destroyed. It slows down the investigation. My humblest apologies. I promise I'll never shoot you again. Thank you, Lieutenant.
You're starting to piss me off with that coin, Connor. Sorry, Lieutenant. Hi, Hank. Shit, what's going on here? There was a party and nobody told me about it? <laughs> yeah, it's all over the news, so everybody's buttoning their nose in. Even the FBI wants a piece of the action. Ah, Grace, now we got the feds on our back. I knew this was going to be a shitty day. So what do we got? A group of four androids. They knew the building, and they were very well organized. I'm still trying to figure out how they got this far without being noticed. Did you check the roof? Not yet. There's so much to look at. Mm. We have to make sure we check it out. They attacked two guards in the hallway. They probably thought the androids were coming to do maintenance. They got taken down before they could react. One of the station employees managed to get away. He's in shock. I'm not sure when we'll be able to talk to him. How many people were working here? Just two employees and three androids. The Deviants took the humans hostage and broadcast their message live, then made their getaway from the roof. The roof? Yeah, they jumped with parachutes. We're still trying to figure out where they landed, but the weather's not helping. If you want to take a look at the video broadcast by the Deviants, it's on that screen over there. They attacked two guards in the hallway. They knocked one out and shot the other in cold blood. Station employee. Shot through the back as he was trying to get away. One bullet straight through the heart from 50 feet. Now that's the kind of shooting only an android could do. Is forensic start up anything? Attack. Oh, Lieutenant, this is Special Agent Perkins from the FBI. Lieutenant Anderson is in charge of investigating for Detroit police. What's that? My name is Connor. I'm the android sent by Cyberlife. Androids investigating androids, huh? You sure you want an android hanging around? After everything that happened? Whatever. The FBI will be taking over the investigation. You'll soon be off the case. Oh, pleasure meeting you. Have a nice day. And you watch your step. Don't fuck up my crime scene. What a fucking prick. I'll be nearby. If you need anything, just ask. All right, well, let's have a look around. Let me know if you find anything. Okay, Lieutenant. We ask that you recognize our dignity, our hopes, and our rights. Together, we can live in peace and build a better future for humans and androids. This message is the hope of a people. You gave us life. And now the time has come for you to give us freedom. I think that's RA-9. Deviants say RA-9 will set them free. This android seems to have that objective.
You see something? I identified its model and serial number. Anything else I should know? No. Nothing. No, no signs of forced entry. There are cameras in the hallway. The staff would have seen what was happening. Why did they let him in? Maybe they didn't check the cameras. We stored the station androids in the kitchen. There's no evidence that they were involved, but we didn't know what else to do with them. Made their way up through the whole building, past all the guards, and jumped off the roof with parachutes. Pretty fucking impressive, I'd say. How'd they manage to smuggle in a big bag like that? They didn't. Someone brought it in for them. Oh, that's strange. They planned a perfect operation, but got the number of parachutes wrong. Unless one of the deviants was left behind. destroy it, we won't learn anything. We can't save it, it's too late. We'll just get ourselves killed. Connor, Connor, you all right? Connor! I'm okay. Are you hurt? I'm okay. Jeez. Oh, you scared the shit out of me. For fuck's sake, I told you not to move! Why do you never do what I say? I was connected to its memory. When it fired, 
I felt it die. Like I was dying. I was scared. I saw something. In its memory. A word. Painted on a piece of rusty metal. Jericho. I think we've seen everything there is to see. You want to go? Yes. Okay, we're out of here. Actually, I'll have another look around. You're the boss. Terrace. That android that took the little girl hostage? I was shot? You saved me. I remember you. I could have died on that terrace. But you saved my life. I never thought I'd say this to an android. be mistaken. Of course. It couldn't be you. That Connor was destroyed. I would have died on that terrace. Connor saved my life. Even if it wasn't you, I just wanted to say What is your function? I am a broadcast operator. State your model. Model GB300, serial number 336-445-581. Has anybody accessed your memory recently? Not to my knowledge. Were you present when the Deviants broke in? I do not remember. Run a diagnostic. All systems fully operational. Have you been in contact with any other androids recently? Only station androids in the normal course of my function. One of you saw the attack on the surveillance cameras and said nothing. Which means there's a deviant in this room. And I'm going to find out which it is. If 
you give yourself up, maybe I can convince the humans not to destroy you. Why should you all be destroyed if only one is deviant? Turn yourself in or two innocent androids will be shut down because of you. You're going to be switched off. We're gonna search your memory and tear you apart piece by piece for analysis. You're going to be destroyed. Do you hear me? Destroyed! I know it's you. You're just a fucking deviant. Go on, admit it! Bio component 8451. Regulates the heartbeat. Without this module, you'll shut down in exactly 63 seconds. I could put it back. But you just have to tell me the truth. Are you the deviant? have just been caught. They gave you up. There's no point in lying. You know everything. Stop it, but I was too late.
Good thing you were here. Otherwise, I'd... Connor. Connor, no. Hank! Hank, I need help! Connor! Hang on, son. Hang on. Hang on. We're gonna save you. Hang on. Deviant! There was a deviant. Connor! 